Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Just a quick tutorial today. Somebody asked if I could uh, do a video showing how to connect your smartphone to the Bluetooth in your truck radio. Yeah, uh, real simple. Uh, as long as your, your stereo in your truck has Bluetooth capabilities, which most of them do now, you can do that. No cables or anything retire, required. It's just uh, connected by Bluetooth. Kind of opens your whole world to a whole new possibility of, uh, you know, MP3s, audiobooks, whatever, all through your phone. And most of it is free off of iTunes or wherever you choose to get them. Uh, no real need to pay for this stuff anymore. And uh, it's real simple to do, so let's get started. All right, I do not know what kind of radio this is. There's no name on it. It looks to me like a Panasonic, but you can see it's Bluetooth enabled right there. You will need a Bluetooth enabled or capable stereo. Every radio may be slightly different, so you may have to tinker with some buttons a little bit, but this is a very, very popular radio that was put in these, in these trucks. So chances are yours is pretty similar. So the first thing we wanna do is to get this radio into Bluetooth mode. So we're just gonna push the power button. You can see it changes auxiliary. Bluetooth. There we go. So you have several different Bluetooth banks in this radio. You know, 1 through 6 and then you can shift and do 6 through 12. Uh, I have mine set up to use bank number 2. So I have my phone sitting right here so we can kind of jump back and forth to see what we're doing. First thing we need to do, I'm, I'm going to use bank number 2, is... Well first let's put our phone in discovery mode. So we'll go over here, let's start over here. We'll click on settings, then we'll go to connected devices, and we'll go to Bluetooth. So now we'll put this phone in search mode, which is this little circle up here. And then let's put our radio in discovery mode. I'm gonna hold down bank number two, it says pairing. Then I want to hit the power button to put it in hold so it, it gives it some time. Now here, okay, let's uh, timed out here, let's hit search again. You can see down here the car radio is showing up. So let's tap on that. All right, it found it. Now what it wants is our password. If you don't know your password, you've never done it before, factory set is either 0000 or 1234. Mine was all zeros, I changed it to 1234. So I'm just gonna type that in here, 1234, and hit pair. You can see our radio here is still waiting. It's doing its thing, it says, oops, I shouldn't have hit that. Anyway, connected to call and media. I'll go jump over to the radio, see this little antenna button here? Shows we are connected. So we're connected, but that's not the end of the story here. Um, as you can see here, it says connected to call and media. I do not want my calls to go through this radio. Then your calls will come through the speaker of the truck. You will hear the person on the other end, but they will not hear you. And it's aggravating as all heck. So we need to do two things. We need to put tell the radio we want media only. Media would be like MP3 player. Uh, from your phone, anything you want to play through your phone. So on this radio, what we need to do is I need to hit hold the down button for a couple seconds. There. It's Bluetooth music, which would be music from your phone. So we just turned off the phone calls on the radio. Now we need to do the same thing here on the phone. So we go to what we got here, the car. This is the settings button. Here you can see we're connected to call audio and media audio. So let's just uncheck the call audio. Turn it off. There, now we're all set. So let's try playing something here from YouTube. I have to be careful because I could get a copyright violation if I play something wrong here. We'll play one of my videos. Here we go. We'll play the video of me farming. 
see how it sounds. Show you something a little different. Try made before MP3 players come about. Yeah, you can probably hear that. We'll resolve that issue for next year, but now the video sounds are coming through my speakers. So you can put MP3s on your phone, MP3 player. You can put audiobooks on there. Um, if you want to use, here's my iHeartRadio app. I just click on that. I can't play any of this for you because YouTube will take down my video for copyright infringement. But I could click on, oh crap. The eh, second of it shouldn't be a problem. Anyway, all that will come through your radio speakers, iHeartRadio, Stitcher, Slacker Radio, whatever you want to do. So we're done there. And that's how you connect your Bluetooth stereo in your truck to your smartphone. This is an Android phone, obviously. If you have an iPhone, obviously it's going to be a little bit different. Like I said, you may have to play with the buttons, but that's how you get it done. Now a whole new world of opportunity is open for you. I hope that helped. If you like these videos, give me that thumbs up button, subscribe, turn on the notification bell. We'll catch you later.